I came here for, uh, to write the NTPL exam and my course was uh, HRD, Human Resource Development. The exam was fine since because I had completed all the assignments, it was uh, cool and easy for me. Since I'm doing MBA and my uh, major specialization is HR and finance, it will be an added advantage for me. And I'm doing my final year, so it will add a weightage for my success. Uh, hello everyone, my name is Nazar Muhammad. I'm actually not from India, I'm an international student. I came to India for uh, studying and I've uh, come to know about MPTEL through my friends and my colleagues and it's actually a very nice initiative from the uh, government of India to increase uh, knowledge and to increase uh, what uh, a bit. very good initiative. I like it very much. Uh, certification is uh, very useful for me because it uh, enhances my employment uh, rate and uh, it introduced me to various knowledge areas and it uh, uh, overall experience is very good. Myself Lucas and I am from DG Vaishnava College. Uh, the exam is really very really, very good and we can make, gain more knowledge and we can be you know we can gain more knowledge and we can be more talent by use, by writing this exam and this exam is really very good and I gain a lot of knowledge and this wine online exam the swine online courses is really very good and I think the certificate will help me in my future in my careers and it will help me in my future yeah hi my name is Harsha Veena so I'm here complete after completing my NPTEL examination so I took my course in the core of my biotechnology field and I got to know about this through my college faculty members. So the uh, overall examination was easier and I uh, had uh, uh, to just go through my assignments and the video lectures which had been very useful for my uh, uh, UG course and uh, I completed my examination and I feel that uh, it will be definitely an add-on to my uh, career. I'm Ilan Go. I'm working as a faculty in uh, VAT Chennai campus. I came to know about NPTEL uh, through our uh, VAT university. Uh, I have uh, taken this course engineering drawing, engineering graphics uh, and it was a new experience atten assign attending the assignments and uh, facing the final exam and the exam was conducted in a <coughs> nice manner in this uh, COVID situation by following all the safety instructions. Okay. Uh, good morning, uh, myself uh, Vijay Krishna, I am working as uh, assistant professor uh, in SRM University, Katangulathur campus. So for this NPTEL exam, uh, I took the course uh, Thermal Processing of Food. So obviously through our college, we know that uh, NPTEL is conducting various type of courses. So through that I have registered. Uh, the course was very informative, uh, the question also very useful and uh, it also helpful uh, for me in, uh, in future scope like research. Uh, the question pattern today what, which I have attended also very uh, expected one. Uh, it is combination of both uh, numerical and theory. Uh, whatever the course teacher have taught, the same pattern uh, has came here. Uh, the two things I want to suggest that uh, I was coming from Mugape, so I felt little bit uh, far away. So that can be taken consideration. So near to my situation, uh, Annanagar or uh, Ambatur, it will be more feasible for me. And second problem, what I faced is that uh, that calculator. When I used that uh, lawn operation or uh, that uh, calculator, little bit I faced that problem. That can be avoided. Registration and payment process, everything is very smooth. Uh, in discussion forum also, I raised few questions. That was answered within a week itself. The only thing is uh, exam center is far away and uh, that calculator I was facing problem today. I'm M. Kiti Vasavan. I'm, I'm doing this NPTEL online course digital circuits for my college credit. And the course was a little bit moderate to tough. Uh, I prepared well for the exam. I thought there might be some assignment questions and theoretical ones, but there was mostly a, a, only a problematics and ones where we have to calculate and it took some time for that. So I think that there were, have to be some theoretical questions. And it all, the question paper was fine, it was not that tough. I'm doing this for my uh, credits and also yeah, very useful uh, as I am studying electronics and communication. This digital circuits is uh, very basic for my course, so I am doing this. Uh. Okay, so I enrolled for course uh, Spacefight Mechanics. So my name is Karthik Narayan. I am pursuing uh, final year B.Tech me Mechanical Engineering in Sastra University. 
So I came to know about this course through college itself. It's uh, it's course for honors course. So I'm doing for extra credits. Thank you. The course was useful and NPTEL was, uh, videos was useful, and I gained uh, knowledge than I know already. Thank you. The registration process payment was uh, smooth and no interruption was there. I'm Yashwant Yam from Sastra Deemed to be University. I've enrolled for the Introduction to Internet of Things uh, course from NPTEL. I had to do this course because it's part of the honors, honors track which is there in my college. So once I finish this co four such courses, I'll be able to gain the honors degree from my college. So the course was overall informative. Uh, it was it was just an introductory course, so uh, nothing uh, uh, bad about the course. So the, the course was overall fine. And then the exam was also easy. That's why I was able to complete within the time. And then uh, overall, it was a good experience. Uh, regarding the portal, the portal could be improved a uh, little bit because uh, the portal is quite slow. So whenever we click on each week, the videos or the assignments, it takes a lot of time to load and at times it doesn't load at all when there is a huge traffic. So the portal could be improved a little bit. And also we need to sign in every time we access something. So it gets signed out automatically very often. So that could be improved. Live sessions are quite informative. So we had I think three live sessions or something. So that was sufficient. So my name is Manas. I'm a second year in uh, IIID DM Kanjipuram. Uh, I enrolled myself for Joy of Computing uh, Python. Uh, the, this course was uh, recommended by our college. It was mandated by a college so that uh, people be more if fluent in programming languages and it will be helpful for them in the future. Uh, regarding the course, the course was very good. I personally liked it. The faculties were from IIT uh, Bombay and uh, all of the IIT faculties. Uh, they thought really well. The co uh, lectures were informative. None of them uh, were repetitive. And uh, assignments were also very uh, thoughtful. Overall, the course was very good and it will be a very good beginner course for anybody uh, hoping to learn Python or any other programming language. Uh, the portal is slow because like a lot of people are trying to access at the same time. Uh, I don't think it can be improved any time, uh, but still it's fine. They are doing the best. Live sessions, uh, I have not been a part of any live session before, but uh, the discussion forums are active. P uh, faculty answers your question if you ask them uh, as soon as possible. Myself, Priya. I am doing my research in commerce. Um, my guide only suggested to do this NPTEL exam. So I have selected a HRM paper. It was uh, quite easy. And uh, still they can improve uh, in case of uh, video session. Still it can be better, sir. Like uh, weekly assignments I have completed. Yeah, content uh, still they can develop. Content, it's not clear, not like that. We are not getting time to win through the videos. So, through PPTs also, still they can have, have some ideas. Uh, my name is uh, Irin Mai, uh, studying in uh, SRMC, and I'm taking a clinical psychology course. This is a uh, electives for us to select a one topic. So, I took this from the college itself. So I am interested in uh, psychology of language and uh, as well as uh, stress management. Uh, so it's better. It's, it's, it's better and it's very useful and it's uh, like para moon for your, uh, for your long time my, for my course. So I took this. Uh, hi, my name is Saran and uh, I am coming from uh, Venkateswara College of Engineering and I have registered for the course uh, Digital Circuits. And uh, I came through this, uh, I came about this course uh, through my college and uh, the exam was, uh, I would not say easy, but it was just average. Actually, I was not opting for this course, but my college insisted me to join this course and uh, take the digital circuits examination. And uh, I hope that this certificate will be helpful for me to um, get any improvements in my career and so on. I cannot upload uh, my ID proofs. I faced an issue and uh, took like uh, four to five days and then I finally solved it. Um, my name is Nalin Bharati. I am a final year student at Shastra University. The course I took this time is uh, Introduction to Japanese Language and Culture. Uh, I came to know uh, about this course through my college and I did this course as a part of my college's op uh, open elective. 
and uh, it was a very good experience because I was always interested in learning Japanese but I did not know how I could do so. So by enrolling in this course I could get a, a good starting point to where I could learn Japanese more. Actually it is uh, useful because apart from my interest this course has also been a part of my college's open elective so it has helped me finish a course a four credit course and also i feel like before i take the actual japanese n5 exam this might this certification might give me confidence only thing if i had to say a bit long i guess for a per week we had a, almost 4 hours of videos to watch so that might be a little difficult for people who are not like very focused or determined to do the course. But the quality of the videos was good. I feel that, uh, I felt that test was quite challenging actually. Compared to the assignments, the assignments were quite easy. So I feel that maybe the assignments could be made more difficult or we could be provided some kind of sample papers. Uh, Japanese has this uh, part called kanji. So those, those were not given much importance in the assignments. But here in the test, we got quite a few questions from them. So people who haven't actually been preparing for that and they have kept uh, preparation in mind with respect to the assignment may have found it a bit difficult. Okay. So myself, uh, Ilakya, I'm doing my psychology master degree and I found the uh, NPTEL course uh, was very useful for the students who acquiring knowledge other than their uh, core papers. Also, I came to know about this NPTEL uh, from uh, our college as they wanted to do a, a elective course uh, with the NPTEL support. So we chosen NPTEL course uh, as a four week and uh, eight week courses and, and I think lots of uh, duration courses and also uh, more uh, uh, programming courses also available in the sites. And I took uh, body language and uh, psychology of language as a, a four week and a eight week course and it was quite uh, interesting and I found videos and uh, PPTs, all the content was uh, clearly explained by the tutors. Con content of the thing can be reduced I think because as a four week course, I know because uh, or, or four week should, should com comprise of uh, at least some amount of uh, basic knowledge I know but it feels a little bit uh, more in uh, during eight week courses it feel uh, it, it comprises with more uh, amount of uh, stuff into the subject because this was the first time I'm uh, entering this uh, NPTEL exam so I didn't face any kind of difficulties and also uh, registering and uh, payment of fees also selecting of uh, courses and uh, selecting of centers was everything was fine the thing the centers can be in, uh, in near the city sites I, I feel because uh, people are from various uh, hostels have uh, felt uh, difficulties from our college because they have been due to this pandemic situation they aren't uh, uh, really in the in the cities in the same area they have been went to the same area where they have been uh, heritage so they face a lot of dif difficulties to come over here and choose a different centers where should be doing the centers update. So find uh, the centers can be in more of in the uh, nearby city areas I feel and also no payment issues and it was very clear once the payment done everything was clear and no refund or any kind of an, uh, difficulties and also a mail was being uh, intimated uh, every time uh, through mail every kind of information was being gathered it was really effective and also uh, regarding the examination, I find uh, you can be they uh, give us a kind of uh, what kind of questions you, you are asking like either pattern of the paper, yeah. yeah pattern of paper can be uh, told before it because it will be useful to uh, prepare for our examinations either it's a MCQ or a fine mark because uh, I felt uh, uh, some of the people uh, went through fine mark and two mark questions in the last moment they felt very difficult to face those questions. Before, if you are intimating, it will be useful for the preparation purpose. Thank you. Hi, myself, Sarun and Jay, and I am working as assistant professor in uh, Vail Tech University. So actually, this session, uh, I have registered a couple of courses. Today, I was writing a pattern search for engineers and lawyers. So uh, actually, I am uh, in the pursuance of uh, domain certification regarding patterns uh, in management domain. So that's what uh, that's why I chose that particular course this session. 
Yes, actually regarding a uh, faculty member, uh, it's being a very much uh, important important uh, scenario uh, for getting uh, uh, certifications, especially that too in our own domain and uh, very much uh, required uh, concepts. It seems uh, a great thing uh, uh, being a part of uh, NPTEL uh, student community, and it get, it helps me a lot actually. So. Because uh, research is all about getting to uh, know about the new things uh, on a regular basis. So I see these courses and those uh, uh, lectures as uh, opportunity to know about uh, the new, ha new happenings in the domain. NPDL, uh, actually I, I started referring NPDL while my uh, PG, but I didn't know about the online certification courses at that time. So after joining uh, as assistant professor only, I came to know about uh, uh, NPDL online courses. So especially, of course, I am a regular, uh, you know, watcher of uh, those websites. So I came to know directly from NPTEL websites only. Okay. Yes, actually, while comparing uh, MOOC platforms, we need to talk about uh, the quality of the videos, especially because uh, in a parallel session, we are uh, we are seeing a Coursera platform as well and NPTEL platform also. So when I uh, need to compare these two. Uh, there is a lot of uh, attitude adjustment is uh, required from uh, the learner side. Uh, in case of uh, why NPTEL is not like uh, Coursera. So yes, that would happen, but uh, it's on the way I am uh, hoping. But apart from that, uh, regarding NPTEL alone, certain courses are uh, uh, simply having uh, uh, very lengthy videos. That was the major concern for me. So the video length might get adjusted, no matter how many videos that we are having uh, per uh, week, but the length of video makes uh, serious uh, about committing into the, the course till last. Yes, assignment part, uh, it's fine. So we actually, uh, since uh, being a faculty, it's a uh, uh, tight schedule for us uh, to uh, cope up with a couple of courses at a time. So we would allocate a particular uh, day or uh, date before the due date so that to carry out assignment as a group uh, activity along with our uh, colleagues with uh, whatever courses that we are having. So that was fine actually. Assignments are, uh, uh, when I compare uh, course around uh, NPTEL, NPTEL assignments are on par with uh, those course or platforms. And live sessions, uh, unfortunately I have not yet attended such live sessions so far. But I have gone through all these uh, procedures, how they are intimating that, how they are getting the questions for uh, live sessions. I have uh, gone through. That was a good thing, actually, uh, that uh, 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 fills the gap that uh, this course has actually happened some four years back and they are rerunning it again and again. But still, the faculty is, uh, uh, you know, enduringly available for uh, clarifying the students' doubt. That's a good part, actually. Uh, payment, I have a huge concern about that because 1,000 uh, rupees is a very large amount uh, for a course. And uh, especially for uh, faculty, last couple of years, they are aligning with uh, AACT faculty development program certification. That is good, actually. But uh, as an individual course and respective payment is uh, uh, more. So that that is uh, my thing. Portal and all is fine. So uh, last uh, uh, semester, it was uh, changed into uh, Swayam altogether. So it's fine, no issues with the portal and the network connections. But uh, one thing is uh, regarding the placement of uh, exam centers, uh, I, I actually think that, uh, okay, if I uh, register for the exam very early stage, then I would get uh, my own, uh, uh, the first priority uh, exam center, but that's, that didn't happen this time. I belong to Aoud in R Chennai. And I need to travel a lot this time, this session especially. Yesterday I had uh, courses in uh, SRM College, which is so uh, extreme boundary of same Chennai. So that uh, is a concern. So the because uh, we are having exam centers in very nearby our college itself, but I have never have a exam center in that college. I always need to travel. So that maybe uh, get focused for the progress you learn us. Hi, uh, my name is Swaminathan. Uh, I just finished the NPTEL exam on uh, patent search. I have taken this exam because I wanted to get into the patent domain certification. NPTEL has got a fantastic feature which uh, allows you to take a number of courses 
and become certified in the domain. So I am taking about three subjects this time. One such exam is just what I finished. It's called patent search. In terms of uh, teaching, in terms of uh, the support available in the discussion forum, uh, absolutely fantastic. Uh, even the exam facilities today are uh, awesome. The only suggestion I have is that the keyboard becomes stuck another thing because of frequent use. I think somebody should keep examining. But otherwise, uh, both the arrangements in terms of academic as well as the exam arrangements are fabulous. Uh, NPTEL, I have been a regular user of NPTEL. Um, this is my sixth or seventh exam, I forgot. And I'm a regular user, both in terms of quality uh, and in terms of support available. I really enjoy this. I look forward to taking more courses. So to become a domain certified in this area called patents, I need to take a certain number of core courses and optional courses. So I am taking uh, uh, basically three courses this time. And in the next cycle, in the January uh, 21 cycle, I intend to take the remaining to finish this actually. It, it is very useful because from this, um, it depends on the interest, right? You see, you've got to be interested in taking a domain, right? There should be a purpose. The purpose could be simply because of uh, interest in that area. You want to learn more or you want to do higher studies or you want to go for a research. For example, if you take this patent, there is an exam called patent agent exam, which is by uh, Patent Office of India. Actually, somebody who wants to become, uh, let's take a final year engineering graduate, uh, who wants, so he can actually do this patent domain, get a fantastic basic knowledge, and then uh, go and study better to prepare for that exam. That's one use. Or you want to pursue specific law, legal courses in intellectual property, this could help you. So I think people should understand what's the purpose and then do it. I do it for both purpose. One is primarily for enjoyment, for learning in this area. Second, I may decide to use and sit for patent agent exam later, but that gives me an option. The qualities are pretty good actually, uh, both in terms of video and in terms of the content. See, content, there are always two suggestions. One is breadth of the content and the depth, right? But that is limited by the course time. Some of the courses are for four weeks, some are for eight and some are for 12. For example, if I take the patent search, which I just completed, it's an eight week exam run by IIT Karakpur and the Rajiv Gandhi School of International Property. So it's extremely good. In terms of faculty, we don't have any problem. Another course I took yesterday, and that is from Dr. Feroz Ali, who is from IIT Madras chair. So we have no doubt about the, uh, the, the course expertise and the teacher's expertise. I also want to place it on record, the amount of support available in the discussion forum. That is very important because what is the difference between an offline and online, right? Online, you only rely on, you have to raise the questions. Uh, so the support is uh, really fabulous. Hello and welcome to everyone. I'm B. Manirajan. I have came to, through, to know about this NPTEL course in my college during my second year. Uh, and I was and I was motivated by my college to do this course. I did my course on heat transfer today, which was very useful for my engineering su subjects and other field applications. It This course helped me to enhance my knowledge about the, uh, in my uh, in my placements or in my higher studies. I've been associated with St. Peter since the program started. So in the initial days, uh, we used to purchase CDs from IIT. Later on, then uh, the same classes, we had it in uh, CD-ROMs. Once you published in uh, YouTube, it was quite popular. But it became more popular once you started conducting the exams and uh, I've been writing this exam at least for the past three years. And uh, I've been watching the number of students who are writing the program. It's almost increasing year by year. This year it is the highest number of uh, people have attended the course here. I see more students are writing here and even the faculty members uh, have uh, the numbers of faculty who are attending these programs have increased. And in some institutions, they do attend this course or attend this exam for credit transfer. And how it helps us is, it helps us to learn a new skill at least. At least I would have learned uh, so many other skills other than my core subjects by these programs. I think these programs are uh, quite helpful. And uh, one suggestion which I want to give to the NPTEL authorities is they can convert these lectures to textbooks and they can attach the textbook with the course material itself. Uh, I think this uh, textbooks would uh, improve the quality of technical teaching in the country as well as uh, it would increase the popularity of NPL more than what it is now. 
So it is a very easy process. The registration, registering for this course, of course, if you want uh, only knowledge, it is free only. Only if you want a certification, you have to write an exam. Otherwise, it is uh, quite economical. I think it is the cheapest in the world. I think so. Right? You do have other equivalent things, sir, but it is the quality-wise, it is not something like this. It is quite flexible. Four weeks, uh, eight weeks, twelve weeks. Uh, and of course, uh, one good thing about NPTEL other than all the other things is the focus part. I think you have to compulsorily write an assignment every week. So, you are more focused on this NPTEL than with other things. For example, you do also have the private things where you don't have the assignment part, where you can do anything on your own at any time. But here it is not something like that. It is the duration is fixed, your assignment time is fixed, your exam time is fixed. This would help you to focus more on the subject than any other uh, MOOC platforms. And of course, uh, other than this, I have done some courses where you have been offered the software also. For example, MATLAB software. Suppose if you are doing a course on MATLAB, they give you free MATLAB software, licensed versions. Right? And uh, in some cases, um, uh, I was told by somebody, they were offered uh, something which normally you won't get it uh, elsewhere in some other platforms. And you know, I think uh, it's a good service from uh, NPTEL. Uh, they should improve it further and they should take it to the next level by more publications. Uh, uh, my domain as of now is uh, started with uh, patents. Uh, and the new course, uh, what is that? The, the new system that they've got it to, is it? Domain speciality. I think this would. Uh, improve the popularity of this course because more faculties are doing the course within the specified domain. Uh, in fact, I have registered for six courses this time only to get the domain certification part of it. And uh, the programs are also very challenging in those uh, domain levels and all. Not all programs are very easy. Uh, there is a small amount of challenge in this to complete the domain certification also. You will not get the certificate very easily. You have to do put in some effort to get the, the domain certification. I think that is a very welcome move, the domain specialization part. Uh, at least in our area, uh, they could increase the number of uh, uh, domain certifications. In electrical engineering, there are only four. I think you could increase it to four or eight and all. And uh, there will be, you don't have separate thing called electronic, something like that. They could increase the number of domain specifications so that uh, uh, more number of people will do the courses. and. Uh, of course, overall, I think the quality of education or technical education would improve because of this NPTEL alone. Discussion forums have participated, but most often you don't get doubts at all, right? It is uh, maybe for a layman, if at all you have a doubt or if you want to have a chat with them, you can do. It is good. Uh, but uh, most often if you have a put a query and all, if you put a query, normally it gets answered. You don't need a forum for that. Uh, to have a live interaction and get an answer. If at all you have any doubt, you can put a question, it gets answered. Most often it gets answered. Even if it's a silly question, it gets answered uh, by the teaching assistant. Somebody answers the questions. This is Dr. A.K. Subramani. I'm working as an associate professor and head in the Department of Management Studies, St. Peter's College of Engineering and Technology. Actually, I did the, the St. Peter's course and uh, both Jan uh, to April session as well as December, November to December, that is uh, July to December session. And the topic of course I did uh, was uh, three courses actually I did this time. That is uh, human resource development, principle of human resource management and leadership. And I find uh, I, this particular course is very useful for the enrichment of the knowledge as well as even the students can do this particular kind of course, okay, so that they will be getting more exposure in terms of the subjects as well as the industry expectation. If they can fulfill the industry expectations. And uh, the course were run with a lot of videos and assignments which uh, instigate the students to learn more. And even the faculty who are teaching those subjects also able to get more information from the experts in the subject concern subject domain. So, and the assessment part also uh, was very interesting and it, it instigate us to learn more. Uh, I found that it is very user friendly so that the people can learn and uh, access the system at any point of time uh, to access the as to do the assignments and to access the videos and uh, even uh, the presentation the materials whatever they provided is also very useful apart from that 
when we are going for the registration of the exam as well as for making the payment for the NPTEL course and uh, choosing the options everything uh, I found it is very easy and user friendly so that and uh, even the kind of exam pattern they have uh, the software they develop for the assessment of the uh, subject is also very good it is very user friendly and uh, I didn't find any difficulty even the common man or the, the, sub, the person with common uh, technical knowledge or computer knowledge could operate the system and can get the benefit of the system. Uh, so my name is Vinod and uh, I am coming from Chennai. Uh, since I am today I written the NPTEL exam, I applied for applied optimization for uh, MI plus uh, big data and today exam was nice and since this exam is came from my professor, he recommended to take the exam. So I came here and today I taken the exam and uh, since it is going on well. Uh, so today see means uh, so much of exam is written today uh, 19th uh, December and uh, uh, since the question also is liberal and uh, the course is very nice and uh, for NPTEL I recommend for to take lot of people uh, because the course is very nice and uh, even exam also they are conducting very good and the feedback also they are giving uh, step by step instruction of very nice. I say that please take the exam and uh, uh, please uh, come on and take the exam and thanks for uh, uh, coordinating for uh, from IIT Madras came here and taking uh, feedback as well as the managing the exam also very nice. So thanks to all. So I am not facing any issue in the portal. Uh, since even I am applying online uh, payment also, they are getting the feedback immediately from uh, feedback team. It's good and nice and recommending to take a lot of people this exam. Yeah, uh, uh, good afternoon. Uh, my name is Lakshmi Narsimhan. I work for a German multinational engineering consultancy called Fischner. I head the site services uh, as a general manager. Uh, I have today came here to write, uh, I am basically a mechanical engineer. So, uh, I actually I underwent a course on financial accounting at IIT Mandi course. So, I came here to prepare, write the exam. Earlier, of course, I did uh, complete uh, a course on solid waste management. So, per se the course conducted by IIT Mandi is excellent actually the way the faculty conducted was wonderful, it was very, because I am purely a hardcore engineering guy and for me to understand the basic concepts of accounting and finance, it was a wonderful 12 week course and today the exam, in fact I did not come prepared for the exam because of my busyness in the office, I just came and I finished off all the questions because the way the faculty taught Dr. Mandel, excellent it was. The only thing is today I had a very peculiar issue, the you know I am, I live in a, in a place called Ambatur and we have a center very close to that. I had applied for that center but uh, the center allocated to me was Chennai Institute. The Chennai Institute, the address is given as uh, you know Kundratu, I put on the Google. It landed me somewhere some, some 10 kilometers away from here. So, 8.45 I was there and the, the Google uh, whatever was showing nothing was there. Then I asked, no, they said uh, you travel back 8, eight kilometers. So, I came rushing, 9.05 I rushed inside. So that was the only, otherwise, yeah, otherwise it's a, it's a wonderful experience. In fact, I registered for German also for the next semester, German. Absolutely no issue. Absolutely. In fact, my son is writing through his college for tomorrow power electronics in NPTEL. One of the is one of the curriculum for them. Okay. So he also didn't find any problem, and it's it's all fine. Now, as far as suggestion is concerned, uh, uh, solid waste management I did uh, last year, uh, and compared to last year and this year, I am seeing lot of centers have increased. You have increased the exam centers also. There has been good improvement. I think uh, to some extent the study materials they can make it see what happens if the study material comes out as an output of the PowerPoint presentation. Probably the fac faculties may not have time to make a separate kind of you know notes. Uh, for people like us you know if some short uh, material is made it will be good. Yeah I did, I did, I did attend the live interaction with him, it was, it was good, excellent, it was wonderful. Thank you so much. I'm uh, Deepa. Yeah, I'm Deepa. Uh, I uh, did a course on introduction to proteomics by uh, Professor Srivastava from IIT Bombay. 
it is a very very nice course and uh, all the modules were very interesting and it was thought with uh, special uh, industrial experts coming and uh, having discussions also and uh, the animations given were also very excellent uh, very good teaching profile uh, so that we were able to understand uh, and there were a lot of repetitive uh, informations coming which made sure that it uh, went inside our minds well so it was actually uh, very good and the lecture material that was provided at the end also was uh, very useful for preparing for the exam and uh, i should uh, make a special note of thanks to professor shrivatsava to making us know about all these uh, proteomic tools and uh, giving some live demonstrations also on it that is number one and number two i should appreciate uh, the excellent uh, examination setup that was uh, given we were actually worried about how the safety aspects and things will be uh, during the examination process but it was very very uh, user friendly and as an individual i could handle without any help i was able to manage the whole process and uh, there was ample good time and uh, to reassure that my questions were good and uh, i am very happy about the overall course as well as the examination conduction thank you so much one thing which i wanted to study the, the lecture materials which were coming though it was useful there were certain uh, what to say mistakes and things like that probably the teaching assistants who did the transfer of the material some care should be taken uh, could be taken i won't tell uh, it should be done but it could be taken to make sure that the material is stand alone and is excellent it's just an updation it's just an improvement not a bad uh, Hello, my name is Akash. I am from PS Jaitek. Uh, I got to know NPTEL from our college staff. Then I started doing NPTEL courses. Uh, today I wrote a foundation engineering exam. Uh, the, co uh, the lectures were very useful. It made me to understand the concepts clearly. In our college, the concepts were not taught not so clearly, but NPTEL videos uh, taught us the basic uh, from basic to the uh, core. So it was very useful for understanding the basic and. Uh, uh, for uh, solving sums also it was very useful and for our uh, anonymity exams also uh, doing NPTEL was very useful for us and the exam, exam, the exam, the conduction of exam also was very good. Structure domain, uh, more uh, two courses. I did structure analysis and matrix method of structure analysis now. Then I have to do uh, structure dynamics and uh, uh, and uh, oh, yeah, strength of materials. Live, uh, we can do it on a uh, Google Meet like that. Okay. On other than YouTube. Instead of typing, if you can express in words, it will be very easy for us. This is K. Jnana Prasanna. I have been working as a research, uh, teaching faculty for the past 13 years. When I was working in Alpha Institute, Porur, uh, they know, there only one of my colleagues, uh, my, actually my HOD told, uh, in order to upgrade my career, um, so I did one course and I, as soon as I joined, uh, uh, the course was Computational Fluid Dynamics and as soon as I joined, I got placed in, uh, after uh, that I got placed in VIT uh, for, as a research scholar, I did entrance and I did. So this was my first paper which I did today, Advanced Fluid Mechanics. The course instructor was Suman Chakraborty of IIT Garagpur and all the 12 weeks the courses were very nice. He explained very nice but only thing I felt was, uh, I was from Max background and uh, it is basically physics. So I felt little bit tough. So what, um, the assignments and all I am ab able to score like 60 to 70 marks I was able to score, not to the full extent, 60, 70 like that I scored. But uh, positive comments is this, um, a negative is one thing is uh, all the 12 weeks put together we can't able to, uh, that is I myself, I felt like I can't able to read even though I spent two weeks because this, uh, this corona period and uh, I had only uh, online classes in college. So I managed to study. So what I feel is after three weeks, if you give a test, small test, like every week you are giving assignments, apart from assignment, what I tell is like after five weeks, after five weeks, one test like that, test you have to conduct. Uh, if you conduct means it is very, very nice, very uh, live sessions. Yes, uh, but, but I, I didn't have live sessions and all that uh, in, in that, uh, so many people have posted the questions, discussion forum. discussion forum, I was being a member and so many people posted and uh, answers were uh, accordingly given okay. based on that yeah. and that, uh, that too I can able to understand, very good.
very good for uh, uh, people like me. Lecture, con I mean, lecture quality, man. Uh, uh, content audio. is, yes, video, audio, everything. Uh, only thing that uh, background, um, that marker writing and all, even more darker, okay. that alone, again and again, if I view through laptop, it is very comfortable. But uh, every time, uh, we cannot use, since because my child is also using uh, okay. the laptop. So, over phone, it is the clarity only, but speeches and all very excellent teaching. So, since because I have, I have been max background and I was able to do that advanced fluid mechanics, very useful. I am Harapriya, I am from Assassin College, I am doing my third year uh, B Civil Engineering. Uh, I attempted my uh, NPTEL course on uh, reinforced concrete bridges. And I got to know about the NPTEL courses through my college um, and uh, I guess I did well. Yeah, it was, uh, it was quite satisfactory and uh, we got to, um, we ha I had uh, four assignments and it was a one shredded course. I did it for my, uh, you know, a credit transfer in my college. I am Professor Raju. I applied for uh, power system protection. The exam uh, questions were a little bit tough. It was covering the entire uh, syllabus and uh, mostly intricate questions were asked. It is not necessary that I have to take on this, take it as a certificate or something of it to acquire the knowledge I have come. So, for the certificate is not of uh, much importance for me. Okay. It's going to just uh, enrich my knowledge. Mostly it is uh, most of all the courses are covered. Now, this time I have applied for three. That is a two, earlier two, one I cancel it because in the same day. Uh, Two exams uh, it came, therefore I uh, cancelled one. Okay, thank you. So, I am Narsiman. I am currently doing my uh, fourth year in uh, AAAD DM Kanjiburam. So, I have taken the course uh, Advanced Fluid Mechanics uh, in uh, NPTEL. Uh, this course was actually useful for me regarding I was, I, I have already done fluid mechanics in my curriculum. So, I wanted to explore more in this fluid mechanics, that is the reason why I took advanced fluid mechanics in NPTEL. Uh, the course faculty was uh, actually Suman uh, Chakraborty, uh, it was actually excellent, the course was excellent. Uh, the depth in the concepts were also really good um, and the exam was uh, quite challenging, I won't call it uh, really tough, but uh, the level was moderate, the exam level was moderate. So, overall feedback is like uh, NPTEL is doing a great job. Um, uh, regarding what about the, the domain? I mean, now you will get domain, the domain. Yeah, I told like uh, I, I did my fluid, basic fluid mechanics uh, in my college itself during my fifth semester. So, in order to go beyond the scope of the fluid mechanics and going in depth into fluid mechanics and it also helps my project which is I am currently doing my final year project. So, it helps for me to get uh, more uh, concepts involved in uh, advanced fluid mechanics. So, that is the reason I took. The portal was excellent. Uh, there was no hassle in uh, giving uh, money for uh, that is for uh, exams and all. Um, the portal was good, NPTEL portal, Swine portal were also good. Uh, live sessions uh, actually there were not many for my course, but the discussion forum was excellent and uh, thank you. Thanks. I am Dr. Suresh from Assistant College of Engineering. Uh, working as an associate professor in that college and uh, I am since I am in teaching I, I know very well about this NPTEL. So, I am regularly attending these courses. Even two days back I attended a course on steam and gas power systems and today I attended a course on uh, uh, heat exchangers, fundamentals and uh, design analysis. It is really very good actually. The purpose of doing this course was uh, mainly to improve our uh, department activities in our college. So, it will be the, uh, this course are considered as an FTP program for a faculty. So, the FTP program for a faculty always good for uh, uh, college and department. So, that is a major objective of uh, doing this course and again uh, online learning was very good, excellent. Uh, the assignment sections and uh, answer solutions for the assignments again. Uh, then uh, the exams were really, really it was very competitive. It is really good actually and once a student passes this NPTEL exam, he is really going to gain uh, knowledge in that particular field. So, in that way it was, it is not so easy to attend NPTEL, it was really good and uh, the system, the uh, online system was excellent. Again payment is very, very small amount compa uh, comparing this uh, other uh, exams, so it is really appropriate uh, payment. 
the payment was very good, online payment was very easy to pay. Um, the only problem was since we were faculty and once the assignment section everything we it was a 12 week course today I attended an exam on 12 week course. So just 10 days back only I submitted assignments so suddenly the exam dates ran. So little bit uh, tough for preparing otherwise uh, that is the only drawback I had otherwise it was very good really and uh, in future also I am going to attend this kind of courses regularly. That was very good sometimes some answers was not uh, correct. So we posted that immediately within two, three, two, three days to uh, one week they, they were able to correct it and they modified the marks also. Maybe courses later to refrigeration air conditioning it will be better I think. I did not find that actually. So if it is added it will be good for me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Yeah, the course which we have uh, undergone in IPT, NPTEL was uh, excellent and the courses which we, uh, which I went, went, uh, it, it makes me to learn uh, plenty of things from that one and I have registered for a course in uh, Industrial Revolution 4.0 and Introduction to IoT I was done and it was a pleasant experience for me to learn uh, the new technology called IoT where I am doing my research on IoT so it helps me to learn uh, uh, in depth of uh, knowledge in IoT and, and today I am here to write the examination here in Chennai Institute of Technology. Yeah, and I wrote my exam well and uh, in, in each and every semester, each and every half I am just doing my uh, NPTEL course here and this is my fifth course I am doing in NPTEL because I am just grasping more knowledge on it and uh, so it was, a, it was a better learning and also I will share to my students also because I am in the faculty of an engineering college where I am just uh, uh, train my students what I have learned from this. Thank you. It's like a semester where an engineering student is doing, where instead of uh, going on with theoretical kind of things, where NPTEL, uh, uh, it gives an immense pleasure to have uh, uh, better, uh, better, better hands-on on all those things, where, for example, if a student is going on with data structures or object-oriented programming languages, if they took, if they choose those languages as a domain language, and they can go on with this video kind of things, where uh, uh, they can have a better hands-on experience and it leads uh, them to get a placement in better activities. My name is Akash, I'm, uh, I finished my civil engineering in 2017 batch and uh, now I'm pro currently proceeding in, uh, due to COVID time I have no job and uh, currently free, free at home so I pursued this uh, pursued NPTEL uh, domain and I, I wrote exam for uh, uh, glass applications today glass application and design glass applications and I I studied for four to six months and uh, using the video tutorial and I also got got, uh, got the knowledge about the outside experience of the, the college uh, environment and uh, mostly uh, I had no idea after uh, passing my civil engineering uh, these much uh, these much courses are there and no knowledge idea so I tried this take uh, this uh, Tried, tried this NPTEL and uh, and uh, wrote, wrote my exam today. Today and uh, I'm mostly uh, 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 did it for uh, certification knowledge and uh, my career improvement. Uh, career improvement and now I'm uh, uh, I have some idea what to do in next uh, next to coming for the job of job opportunities. Yes, sir. Live interactions. I have gone for for my topic. There wasn't a live interaction. I also applied for uh, other uh, other topics like. Uh, Reinforced, uh, reinforced concrete and uh, advanced concrete technology. They had uh, live interactions and uh, it was very, very well good, sir. And uh, also our questions were answered the last of the session. Hello, myself, myself Hari Haran. I'm working as assistant professor in uh, Anand University Constituent College, Kanjiburam. I selected this course uh, as patent law for engineers and scientists. And uh, I found this course very interesting. I just wanted to apply for patents in future. So that's why I applied for this course. But I found that the, the person who gave lecture during the videos, uh, the presentation was very good, but uh, the technical words that he used were uh, very confusing and uh, he, he might have taken some effort to uh, prepare slides well. The slides were not uh, very properly oriented, and, uh, but the exam was very interesting and the subject was interesting, interesting for me and uh, I did well for the exam. No, no, I am very interested because I wanted to complete this for my career development also. Okay. When I selected the exam center, I selected uh, uh, Kanjibram, okay. but it was very far from this place. Uh, okay. This one suggestion I can. When they select the center for the exam, they can select the area which is close to their uh, residential okay. or workplace. 
Uh, hello everyone, I am Shweta and I am studying in IIT Madras. I am a third year student and here uh, the course which I took was Biomedical Nanotechnology. The reason which I took is because uh, my major is Biotechnology and also Nanotechnology is uh, such a scopeful, um, scopeful branch and many things are uh, now being uh, designed. For example, if you consider the 3D organ printing and all, uh, there are a lot of new and interesting stuff coming up. So, Biomedical nanotechnology was very interesting, so uh, that's the reason why I took this course. And I got to know about this through my college emails. Every year I used to get um, the NPTEL course list, which and all courses have been uh, scheduled when. So uh, it was easier for me to like choose how many week course, and it, it's also useful for my credits for the um, credit requirement and my college fulfillment. So it was very interesting, and the exam was also pretty interesting. So I recommend that NPTEL course is very much useful because you can study it at your own uh, comfort space and also you can uh, get a lot more knowledge where the college don't uh, provide those courses. So regular IITM courses, there are a lot of core courses which you uh, need to do even though it's not your major. But uh, using the courses which you want to study, uh, it specializes the stream which you want to look into because there are no, not much courses on nanotechnology in IIT Madras. But uh, there are a lot of courses around and NPTEL is uh, an easy way because you can uh, study it from your home or from your own uh, space and also attend exams and test your knowledge on the course. So it was very helpful that way. I am Dr. Balaji, Professor of Community Medicine in SRA Medical College. I just took the course on biomedical research. Um, the exam was, being from community medicine background, the exam was uh, good enough, not very tough, uh, but it just uh, helped us in updating our knowledge, the course, and uh, a final completion is the exam part. Yes, uh, generally this uh, certification is required for promotion for all staff, so that's one reason why I applied, uh, but uh, fortunately I got promoted before the requirement came. So, before I have applied, I just complete the course because in future, sometimes the MCA or NMC may make it mandatory for everyone to have the certification even if they are professors, so we have completed it. Okay, the portal generally, I want to give a good feedback about the portal, it was uh, user friendly, the videos were taken well and it's very crystal clear, uh, both the professors and the portal were very helpful in understanding the content and they have the regular assignments in the portal that they were, were able to follow and assess ourselves regularly and that in fact helped in the exams also. Uh, my name is Harish, I am I'm pursuing my final year in Sri Vengadeshwara College of Engineering, Sri Parmuthu. So actually uh, coming to NPTEL, when I joined my engineering itself, I came to know about NPTEL through online itself. So while starting my engineering itself, I tried enrolling the courses, but since I joined engineering, I wasn't able to follow it up. But once I came to my third year, I enrolled course and even I attempted few courses last, uh, I mean like last year also. And this year also I took two courses, one was my, by my personal interest to develop my skills in MATLAB and another course was, uh, it was mandatory for us to take up in college because due to this uh, lockdown, uh, they asked us to take this course uh, through NPTEL which was a subject course. So uh, today I wrote the subject course. So this is how I came to know about NPTEL. Uh, actually, I am uh, still not clear about that domain certification thing. Uh, I, uh, I little uh, know about that minors, they categorize the subjects based on some uh, things, but I am not sure about that. So actually, it's one of the good method of uh, conducting the examination is an online. And uh, as a faculty, uh, I am working in Rajalashmi Engineering College. So it, is, it was very helpful for to uh, get updated with the basic concepts over there. And it just acts as a refresher for us, refresher goes. So it's a very nice uh, initiative by IIT Madras. Thank you. Payment, uh, you can just do some other, uh, uh, you can reduce it for, because when uh, faculty is just writing uh, repeatedly, so it becomes mandatory for the faculty over there. You can reduce the payment over there. That is one of the requests uh, we just proposed to it. Okay. So we are continuously writing over there and we are clearing the paper. So we can just go for it. And uh, experimental wise, uh, FTV score is there, uh, but not all the courses are there. Yeah, so very, very few courses are there. Yeah, uh, I have uh, done uh, four to five uh, NPTEL on domain and also completed, uh, other than the domain and computation, Python, uh, okay. I completed all the courses over there. 
it's very nice that uh, we could able to explore uh, other subjects also so where we cannot do it in a degree it's so like an elective subject uh, it was very uh, experiencing and uh, some of the experimental um, uh, aspects so you can just show the instruments uh, which are available in iit so that people will be updated with the knowledge so because the all the videos are uh, very old videos and uh, some of them are uh, reluctant to some, uh, something new we expect the things to be what because you are the uh, forum and the portal where you get the update so when that has been viewed by the student they will be getting update so if you are giving the old very old videos so there and uh, not any update with the current uh, trend content is not an update okay. since we, we were able to just see so very old uh, something new uh, if you are just adding uh, uh, new instruments are uh, evolved those instruments can be demonstrated and they can be updated at the, the last of the what, last session okay. not even if you could not able to add it in the uh, initially you can just update it as last so that this is the uh, current uh, development so that development can be included i have been attending almost on 8 to uh, more than 8 examinations so it is very well very well formatted so that uh, it goes smooth yeah um, uh, good afternoon i am dr satish uh, i am ent surgeon in uh, ramchandra medical college so uh, the conduct of the exam is good and uh, the social distancing and uh, all this the all the stuffs are uh, neatly maintained except for the selium which was kept uh, just outside the exam hall which was not working other than that uh, it was good and uh, everybody was helpful uh, to us and uh, everything was good yeah the portal uh, the portal and, uh, and the timing and everything was uh, smooth uh, except for at the start of the exam it was uh, a minute or something slow but other than that uh, it was good the certification as such uh, will be helpful for my uh, promotion to associate professor and to a professor grading yeah hi i am aditya from iit madras electrical engineering department uh, i have written the exam for applied natural language processing uh, in lpdl the course was uh, very challenging and actually very interesting uh, weekly assignments were all uh, uh, very interesting and made me think a lot some required the help of internet also like all the material was not covered in the course so it uh, encouraged people to uh, take feedback from yeah, the exams were uh, not subjective so that's the difference i feel at least uh, but uh, difficulty wise it is mostly the same like actually there's a course uh, which was not available this year applied time series the course is name is okay so, so it is not Yeah, I would try to take it this year, but it was not there. Okay, uh, my name is Sai Sundura. I am from SSN College of Engineering. I have done the course programming in Java. Uh, I felt it very interesting. The videos and the demonstration that they gave was interesting, and there's nothing negative about it. It was very useful. We could understand the concepts very clearly. Uh, hi, good afternoon, everyone. I am Dr. Amrita Jansarani, working as an assistant professor in Stanley Medical College. Uh, I uh, did this basic course in biomedical research program. Uh, I came to know this through my professor, who asked me to enroll myself in learning about this, uh, uh, how to do a research project, everything. Um, it was really very interesting. I went through all the lectures which was posted in the course. It was really very useful. and i came to i learned a lot before i teach my postgraduates because we are involved in continuous research programs in a number of clinical trials and i learned a lot i uh, i'm very happy about uh, le- uh, joining this course and the exam too was very good very standard interesting and i wish you all to join everyone should join and get benefited by this uh, yes uh, regarding the peculiarity of this course was they gave number of examples to understand the various um, uh, terminologies uh, usually the community medicine people used to take us uh, many real trial examples and all and this was very useful when compared to the regular lectures uh, very useful to understand many terminologies conduct of the exam is uh, uh, this is the very first uh, online exam i am attending uh, very very interesting and i thought uh, i don't know how to enroll myself how to enter into that very simple very easy and uh, uh, it has been already given in the assignment 
uh, it was uh, you can change the options and you can go till the time is over in the same way the exam was also conducted and uh, because it was already practiced to me it i felt very easy and it is not hard at all very easy to understand the course the conduct of the exam was really good very calm very uh, peaceful i to have a idea of doing some online exams in future thank you myself jay kastad i'm from rmk engineering college uh, i have done a digital course in npdl it is very useful for my career because i am an electrical and electronic engineer so it helps me and uh, sir was santokumar chodhri i think so he taught me more we npdl is more useful ah uh, it's very nice and uh, very interesting and uh, it is different from other uh, websites and other videos it is taking as an uh, it is explaining in a note with a note and pen so it is very useful um uh, regular course means uh, we, we we can't uh, take as much any time it we can take we till you can uh, learn night also night 10 o'clock 12 o'clock we can time any any time we can learn so that it is useful thank you um hi i am aparna uh, i am from uh, shri venkateshwar college of engineering here in chennai uh, in kanjipuram and uh, i wrote my exam for digital circuits today our college actually uh, t- uh, instead of teaching the subject they uh, preferred nptel's course because it was uh, very useful so uh, it was very elaborate and uh, the things were in detail so it was easy to learn and accessible and uh, the exam also was conducted very uh, uh, like properly Every, everything was planned properly and uh, everything was executed also smoothly and uh, this certification uh, I feel like I've actually learned something about digital circuits rather than just uh, like memorize things. I've actually learned something, and I think I'll I'll have this knowledge with me. So this is how the certification is useful for me. Uh, yeah, the yeah the quality is really good. Uh, it's very regular. It's nice that we get detailed solutions for the answers also, and even the live discussion forum was also very useful. And uh, yeah, it was. Thank you. My name is Adi Aran. I am going to study Eeshwari Engineering College. I am going to study problem solving in C programming. That is easy for the course. I am going to study it and elaborate it. I am going to study it in a lecture. I am going to study it in a lecture. ஒரு தேர்ட்டி செகண்ட்ஸ் வீடியோ வரும் தேர்ட்டி மினிட்ஸ் இருக்கும் தேர்ட்டி மினிட்ஸில் வந்து கரெக்டாக வந்து கரெக்டாக எல்லாமே ஃபுல்லாக எக்ஸ்பிளைன் பண்ணிடுவாங்க நோட்ஸ் கரெக்டாக எடுத்துகிட்டு அதே மாதிரி அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் வீக்லி வீக்லி அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் சப்மிட் பண்ணிவிட்டு வந்தால் மோஸ்ட்டாக நான் இப்போ எக்ஸாம் எழுதுனதில் கூட அசைன்மெண்ட் சப்மிட் அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் ரிலேட்டடாக தான் மோஸ்ட்டாக வந்தது நான் நான் என்ன பண்ணியிருந்தேனோ மோஸ்ட்டாக நிறைய கோர்ஸ் இருக்குது நிறைய கோர்ஸ் எது வேணால் என்ரோல் பண்ணி எக்ஸாம் அப்பியர் பண்ணலாம் இதுக்கு சர்டிஃபிகேஷன் கோர்ஸ்க்கு இது வந்து நான் இன்டர்வியூக்காக இன்டர்வியூக்கு யூஸ்க்காக நான் வந்து இது எடுத்திருந்தேன் எடுத்து பண்ணி இந்த க்ரெடிட்ஸ்க்காக ரெகுலர் மீன்ஸ் நம்ம திருப்பி போய் கேட்க முடியாது அவங்ககிட்ட நம்ம டவுட்ஸ் இருந்தால் ரீகால் பண்ணி இது ரெக்கார்டட் வீடியோனால ஸோ நம்ம திருப்பி திருப்பி ரீமைண்ட் பண்ணி கேட்கலாம் எதாவது டவுட்ஸ் இருந்தால் கூட இங்கே இதில் சப்போர்ட் டீம் இருக்குது எதாவது கேட்கணும் கேட்கலாம் அது இல்லாமல் வந்து சர்ச் அதான் அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் இருக்குது ரெகுலராக ஹோம் ஒர்க்ஸ் இருக்கும் மோஸ்ட்டாக காலேஜில் அந்தளவுக்கு இருக்காது எக்ஸாம் டைமில் மட்டும் நாங்கள் ப்ரிப்பேர் பண்ணுற மாதிரி இருக்கும் இதில் வந்து வீக்லி வீக்லி நாங்கள் ப்ரிப்பேர் பண்ணுற மாதிரி அது ஒன்று இருக்கு I appeared for uh, problem solving through programming in C. The paper was uh, both, uh, it was intermediate level, it was an intermediate level. It was not so tough or not so easy. It was challenging. It will be very useful in a career and uh, in credit transfer also. Hello, I am Balaj from uh, Rajalashmi Engineering College. I, I am doing my second NPTEL course this semester. I did the exam well. The exam were uh, easy for those who had uh, submitted the assignments properly, they, this exam would be easy for them. Uh, it was a nice experience in this college. Thank you. I am Asresha, uh, pursuing my chemical engineering in SSN College of Engineering. And I opted for uh, dairy and food products and pro- process and product technology. And I found the course interesting and the professor was really good in helping uh, with the course and also with the live sessions. And this exam was uh, pretty easy. I mean, if you have completed your assignments, and uh, followed the instructions it was very easy it was all good and comfortable thank you